I was working uh, at night shift start to feel like collapsing the next day I would go to the hospital so that's where they found out uh, I having I'm diagnosed with pneumonia I start to notice when I was having constant fever uh, having dry cough and really difficulty of walking. What I'm worried about this illness is that it con might be contagious. So I, I'm worried that it might affect my family members. Yes, yeah. that's right. We don't have any appetite to eat. So that makes us really worried. Said actually had a pneumonia, which is an infection affecting the lung tissue. In pneumonia, the alveoli, which is the air-filled sacs in the lung, are filled with pus and other fluid. This makes it difficult for oxygen to reach the blood. When the lungs are congested with fluids, breathing can also become difficult. In Said's case, the pneumonia was community acquired, meaning he caught the infections from the community instead of from the hospital setting. Respiratory infections can happen when the viruses or bacteria enter your airway. Usually they are spread through water droplets and sometimes through airborne means. What this means is that when somebody coughs or sneezes into a room, the water droplets containing viruses and bacteria can remain in the airspace. So when you walk into there and you breathe in this uh, air and water droplets, uh, the viruses and bacteria can reach your airway. Pneumonia can be life-threatening and in fact, it is one of the most common cause of death of infective causes in Singapore. It is good to schedule a visit with your regular doctor if you're unwell. However, if you encounter red flags such as worsening of shortness of breath, chest pain, confusion or extremely unwell, please visit the emergency department directly. To prevent respiratory infections, uh one of the simple things to do is to maintain a strong immune system. Uh, you can do that by maintaining good nutrition, uh, exercising regularly, sleeping well. Uh, one of the things we also can do is to smoke smoking for those who are smoking. So this is your x-ray. This side showing a pneumonia, which is where the infection is. Mm -hmm. The white part over here, if you can see. This is your windpipe. Right. And this is the right side of the lung. Uh -huh. This is the left side of the lung. Uh -huh. So the fr this area here is like a sponge. Because there's fluid and pus, we cannot see your, your, your normal lung tissue mm -hmm. from the x-ray. Pneumonia affects the lung tissue responsible for oxygen exchange in the body. Unlike the common cold, which usually affects more of an upper respiratory tract with symptoms such as cough and runny nose. Older persons or persons with other medical conditions, uh, sometimes they have lower physical reserves, uh, their immune systems may be weaker, so these conditions become more severe. Fortunately, not everyone with pneumonia needs to be hospitalised. We generally advise hospitalisation for patients who are clinically unwell, elderly or immunocompromised, for closer monitoring as they may deteriorate further. Our family, we don't have this sickness, you see, in our family. Eh? Mm -hmm. For your case, it's like Huh? You know, yeah. everybody was like, ah, what happened? What, yeah. what kind of sickness is this, you know? Yeah. Something very new to all of us. Yeah. Just because you are healthy, just because you are young, you will come to everybody regardless of age. Mm -hmm. So it's better to be self-aware, stay alert and just listen to what your body tells you and get treatment immediately. We would also usually schedule a follow-up with the patient to make sure the symptoms continue to improve and repeat the chest x-ray in around six to eight weeks time to ensure that the infection has resolved. There is a national adult immunization schedule that will tell you at certain ages what are the vaccines that you should be taking. In Singapore, it's uh, relatively easy to get access to these vaccinations because they are available at all GP clinics and also our polyclinics.
You can make appointment through the Health Hub or the NHG Cares app. Residents who are enrolled in Healthier SG, uh, many of these vaccines are free. Exercise more. Exercise more. Uh, yeah. Be more. Drink uh, more. Plenty of water. Drink water. Uh, Eat fruit. Do not too overwork. <laughs> Don't get too stressed at work. Uh, and just, uh, but just uh, be happy. Be happy. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's it. <laughs> All mothers, of course, when their kids are not well or not doing well, of course, we first thing is that we worry very, very well. Say, uh, of course, <laughs> all mothers are, are like that. Yeah, we are very worried for our children, all our children. Yeah, so we want the best for them, all of them.